Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a common challenge that many developers encounter when working with time data. Our viewer asks, how can I convert epoch time to a human readable format while ensuring it reflects a specific time zone? Let's break down the issue. The viewer is using a simple method to convert epoch time, but they're facing a challenge. When users set their device to a different time zone, the display date and time can vary from what the server intends. They want to ensure that the human readable format aligns with the server's time zone, not the user's device settings. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you're looking for. Guys, remember to say just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully you work through to that resolution. Now, let's continue on. To convert epoch time to a human readable format in a specific time zone, we need to understand how JavaScript handles dates. By default, JavaScript uses the local time zone of the user's device. To ensure that the date is displayed in a specific time zone, we can use the toLocalString method. This method allows us to specify the time zone we want to use. Let's see how to implement this. First, we create a new date object using the epoch time. Then we call to local string with the desired time zone. This code will convert the epoch time to a human readable format in the specified time zone. You can replace GMT12 with any time zone you need. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. There are several ways to convert epoch time to a human-readable format. First, you can create a new date object using the epoch time in milliseconds. This will give you the date in GMT and local formats. For example, it returns Wednesday, August 1st, 2018 at 2.11 p.m. GMT. To convert a human readable date back to epoch time, create a new date object with the date string and use the getTime method. This will return the original epoch time, which is vuf 33313267. For more details, check out the Epoch Converter Programming Guide linked in the description. You can also find an interactive example on JS Fiddle. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To convert epoch time to a human-readable format in a specific time zone, this user created a function called formatDate. It uses the IntelDateTimeFormat object to format the date and time. The function takes two parameters the date and a boolean to include time. It formats the date parts and returns a string with the desired format. For example, if you have an epoch time and are in Argentina, 
the output will still reflect Los Angeles time, regardless of your location. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To convert epoch time to a human-readable format, start by setting the initial date to the epoch. For example, if you have a UTC epoch variable stored in seconds, like 123456789090, you can create a new date object and set the UTC seconds. Alternatively, you can use the moment.js library for a more straightforward conversion. Simply use the Unix method to convert your epoch time and format it as desired. Another method involves parsing a specific date format. You can extract the timestamp from a string and create a new date object from it. I hope that's found the resolution that you're looking for and you managed to work your way through your issue. Please, if it did help, hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next technical time you need help, have a good one.